timetable looking at Rex maybe at the end of November and starting yeah. right off the bat here. Has the progress been made? Yeah, better? Lou, um, he got cleared four days ago. And um, he's practiced almost all of practice every day. And uh, my feeling was start him, he's loose from, and, and our goal was, you know, 15 minutes. And um, what do we have him at, 13? I, you know, it's just neat seeing him out there, you know. And, and again, he's practiced for four days and how he defends and how he finds people. And, and then his, just the veteran, just having him back as a veteran and his voice out there, I think can help us. So, you know, I, he, he's, we'll keep, you know, plugging with it, but, you know, he's limited pitch count, but, you know, it's great having him back, man. He, he, he's, <clears throat> you say all you want about him, but, you know, watching him move defensively, because they, they, they run a disciplined pattern, watching him move and guard and switch and talk to a pattern, man, that, he really, he can really guard, and, and he talks, and he, guard, he guards three guys sometimes. And then on the other end of the floor, he's never been a big scorer for us, and that's not going to change. But man, he knows where the ball should go. He knows how to play. He passes. He finds people, and you know. So it's neat having him back, man. He deserves. He deserves it. What kind of night was that for Dane, given everything? Yeah, I, I was. I was through. You know, like you know, you look at like we were a little sheepish on who would shoot it at times last year with those young guys, and you know, he has been more aggressive after turning a lot of shots down as a freshman, which is natural. But he's hunting his stuff and, and driving it. And, yeah, you know, the, the, the mental side of it, you know, knowing him, the competitor that he is, he, he wanted to play well, and he certainly did. I loved his aggressiveness. Mooney, just, a, I mean, another double-double. Yeah, he just, he's just a machine, man. He's a machine. And, you know, he and Jawan have been playing together a lot. That's kind of how we've been starting. And, and I expect that's how we'll start here for a while, uh, and they like playing together. You know, they're almost a little too unselfish. They passed each other or pass up some shots. But, you know, they play they play together. But Johnny's, you know, just got to keep him fresh. He's he's just a machine, and he'll, he should have a great year. He, the, he just gets it done. He gets us started offensively a lot. Is the mask affecting Nate a little bit? When does um, you know, he's been in the mask a while. And, and um, you know, has, has shot it a little better than he did tonight. A little more active, you know. He's sticking his nose in there more and 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 battling. Um, and, you know, I, you just think back to at Pittsburgh, Georgia Tech in the ACC tournament, you know, there's some nights where I think we're going to get more of those out of him. He's just, you know, I think the mask may come off in a week, um, you know, because the nose – was broke a while ago, and now it's precautionary. But um, when was it broke? Uh, I would have say three, weeks ago. three, yeah, three weeks. So, so he he's probably close to getting out of the mask, you know. Uh, and I love the fact that he's pulling up like Dane. He was aggressive, you know. We we you know we, we you know, and that's why we're trying to play a little faster. Just don't think that we thought about stuff too much at times last year. Just pull up and shoot it, and he, he's gonna. He's, he'll he'll win some he'll win a bunch of games for us with what he does from outside out there. How close are you to figuring out a rotation? Yeah, the guys and minutes. Like you only have one guy play thirty minutes. I know. Yeah. Well, I know you, I know you want to take it slow, but that Wednesday's closing quick. Yeah, yeah. You know, you probably uh, the minutes probably won't look like that on Wednesday. Yeah. Hey, they may not look like that on Friday if if these guys played Louisville. That you know, all of a sudden that bench, as we know, can shorten when it gets to crunch time. Um, you know, but but all the guys coming off the bench right now have to stay. It we need them all all year. Chris will be back probably by Friday. He had the four wisdom teeth taken out, and and so he'll be back. But we, that's ten guys then. Ten like I think we're going to need all of them throughout the year. I, I don't know if I'm going to get them all in the game in Chapel Hill, but we're going to need them all throughout the year the way this thing goes. Robbie, the consummate. Guy off, spark off the bench. And yeah. They hit the three and you had him report right in. Yeah, he's, um, you know, he's a downhill physical guy. Um, you know, I, I he drives it for us. You know, sometimes we we can we can move it around the perimeter too much. 
like a hot potato. And I'm thinking back to last year's stuff we're trying to work out of. And I told him, if you get it on ball reversal, just drive it. Drive it. If you charge, you charge. I think you're going to get fouled more. He just makes stuff happen. The thing that was interesting to watch tonight was him pick up the other point guard, three-quarter court, and just wear a ball handler down, where Prentice does that. And I don't know if you need TJ to do all that, but Robbie could do that. You know, just watching tonight. Like, and we got some guys that can pick up. We got some bodies we can play. And, and uh, you know, so he, he's he, he's been healthy and physical, and there's a great toughness about him. Coach, do these games kind of obviously, you know, being an exhibition in nature help you get ready for games like North Carolina? Well, I don't, I don't you know what, I don't know because this has never <laughs> happened before, you know. Uh, um you know, the one thing the one thing I think's happened is because our guys know they've got a lead game right out of the gate and that opponent, I think our practices have been a, another level because they see what's coming right away. And I, these guys have good work habits anyways, but I think there's been a little and I've reminded them, hey, 12 days, you know, eight to, you know, so I think it's almost helped us be better in practice because of how we're starting out next Wednesday. Thanks, guys. See you Friday. Thanks. Thanks.